Everybody, welcome back to Plugin Tut, your home for handcrafted WordPress plugin tutorials. And I have a super basic video today. You might want to skip this if you're a WordPress veteran. It's how to set a drop down menu in WordPress. And let's just set the table. It's one of the most common questions I get, and one of my most popular videos, the 2017 theme. So I'm going to show you that. Uh, in today's video, but this will work virtually on any WordPress theme so long as the theme has a drop down menu actually styled within its code. So this is something that shouldn't even happen these days. I mean, every theme should have a drop down menu support. Maybe there's a limit to the tiers of drop downs that it has, but every theme should have a drop down styled. Let me show you two different ways that you can access this. Remember, I'm using the 2017 theme and we're going to go to appearance. We're going to go to menus and I already have a simple menu set up. Uh, it's called main menu. You can see that right here. It's got home, blog, about and contact in it. But what we have to do first is assign it a location on the theme. Now, some themes have multiple areas that you can put menus in. And for this one, we're going to click on manage locations. And you'll see there's two menu uh, locations here, uh, the top menu, which you can uh, suggest as the primary menu, the only sort of menu area in this theme. And then the social links menu, which in the 2017 theme will actually turn your social media links into icons. But let's assign this main menu to the top menu, save changes, and we'll visit the site. Now you can see here, here is the menu that I just placed before it was just a blank space. But how do we get pages to become a drop down of let's say the about section or whatever page you want. Uh, from here, I'm going to show you a different way to look at the menu system and that's going right into the WordPress customizer. So you can do this in both places. You can do it in the admin screen that I just showed, or you can do it right here in the customizer. We'll go to menus. We'll look at the main menu. And remember, this matches up directly home blog about contact. Same thing on the left hand side. We're going to add an item here. Uh, let's just use this Gutenberg page. And you'll see, I'm going to hide the controls. The Gutenberg page just went right to the end of that menu. Let's set it as a drop down by simply grabbing it and then dragging it right under the about page. And you can see the little uh, styling difference There's a little arrow that now points down on the about link. And then when I hover over it, that Gutenberg drop down page is right there. And you can make as many of these drop downs as you want. In fact, let's just take a look at one more time. I did not test this first. Let's just see a uh, sample page. We'll even drag that under Gutenberg and let's see if there's another tier to the drop down about Gutenberg sample page. So now that's three different uh, sort of levels there, your primary level, your secondary, then your tertiary, uh, and then maybe it even goes a fourth sector. I don't know, that'd be a pretty deep uh, menu. But that's how you do drop downs or that's how you set drop down items in a WordPress navigation. Remember, really the only caveats are maybe you have a theme that doesn't have drop down styled, which would be super, super rare these days. Uh, or maybe you've developed some kind of customized site. Uh, maybe using Elementor or Beaver Builder and you didn't take into account for those stylings. But again, it's a very rare instance that that won't work for you. Now, what won't what you might not find in your particular theme are the different menu locations. That's a whole different ball game. These themes have to have menu locations for you to place these larger menus and primary navigations into. But that's it. Super easy. I hope that helps some of you. I know it's a very common question, especially for the 2017 theme. If you like it, thumbs up. If you want more, subscribe to the channel. Tell your friends and family. It's PluginTut.com. PluginTut.com slash subscribe to join the mailing list. Well, we'll see you in the next video.